I uh, came upon the idea of using the mountain as a form of training because when I lived in Australia, there was a really great coach named Percy Soretti and he used sand dunes and his guys ran up sand dunes repeatedly as part of their training in Portsea. And so when we moved it up on the mountain, I had started running up the wall and could see that it gave a lot of benefits in about three different areas. First, physically. Physically, you know, you're always facing obstacles in your life and this mountain running up the wall is a considerable obstacle. And so it, it helps your body adjust to difficult situations. And so we started doing hill repeats, mountain repeats, where we would run from the bottom of the mountain and run to the top and then take the chair down. And the boys would do that repeatedly and then do a long run up on top. And we could see the benefits of it right away. It was not only helping them get stronger, but it also thickened their ligaments uh, their tendons, their muscles grew stronger, and obviously it had great benefits for their lungs. So we continued to use running up the wall as a form of training for both track and cross country. And it was, it was very effective in keeping the boys healthy. We had almost no one hurt for about a period of six years. And a lot of other teams had a lot of their guys get injured while they were running. But I really believe that uh, running up this mountain toughens your body and it does toughen you to uh, hard training, but it also reduces the impact when you land with your feet, the mountain meets you. And so there's less red blood cell destruction as you're hitting the ground with your feet. The mental benefits are, are many, but one of them is that when you're in a race, there's always tough parts in a race. And when you're running up the wall, uh, it's gonna be tough, no matter if you're having a good day or a bad day. And it helps you mentally know that you can push through things just because it's hard, doesn't mean you can't push through them. When you run the wall repeatedly, uh, because it's at 43 degrees, uh, it is going to put you to the test mentally. If you get used to dealing with difficulties in a race and you know that you've done it in practice, then when you get to the race, it doesn't seem as hard. And so I felt like our boys were much tougher mentally for having run up the wall. And then there was the emotional aspect of, in life, you're always facing difficult situations. Sometimes you're sick, sometimes you're injured. Uh, but we all have things in life, uh, disease, things that we have to face. And getting your emotions in a place where you know that you've uh, dealt with situations that your emotions were saying you couldn't do it, but you did it anyway, that helps you deal with those ups and downs that comes with life and the mountains that we all face in life. And so the mountain literally uh, helped us I think emotionally get tougher as well as physically and mentally get tougher. Intervals on the wall are what build a foundation for state championships, national champions, and American records.